lovely people. Coupon and Crystal here with a stockpile update. Yes, let's do a stockpile update because number one, I haven't done one in a very long time, but I will link the other videos that I've done in the past of my stockpile below so you guys can do a comparison of my stockpile before as what it is now, okay? And the second thing is that I have not consistently did coupon in about a couple of months, okay? So I think that's very important to this video, all right? So let's look at the stockpile and let's see what I've got left. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Now, for this video, y'all know I had a leak in this room, so I had to put my stuff back in here <laughs> to do the video for you guys. So let's start over here. All right, you see a little sheet rock down there, but it's all right. <laughs> all right, so the You Buy Kotex products, I promise you guys, I haven't bought sanitary products in Lord Jesus. I can't tell you when, because when they had this stuff at Harris Teeter Super Double for free, burnt up the deal, okay? It worked out to where these things were free, and I'm telling you, I burnt up the deal and I had so many panty liners, it was crazy. I was actually selling the panty liners. So, okay, you can see I have tampons, I have pads, I have liners. I've got another thing back there of, what is that? I think that's liners, that's liners, that's a box of liners back there. And what is this right here? Pads, okay, liners, pads or something. All right, so just had a bunch of those things. Was killing, killing the deal. And that was gonna fall and we just gonna let it. This right here, this stuff right here is some Shea Moisture. And you know what, it's so funny because my sister and I, we bought this at Harris Teeter and it ended up having a coupon. Let me show you the price, okay? It ended up having a coupon and yeah, it ended up having a coupon. So we definitely didn't pay no two ninety seven dollars because we had a Shea Moisture coupon but it ended up being a good deal. And I did not realize that it was like, I think it's a grooming shave. See, it's a male product. Girl, we thought it was, we thought it was some body wash, but that's all right. It's still a good deal. I done had this right here, this, <laughs> this dish detergent booster. I think it's for your dishwasher. I done had this stuff for a minute. All right, I got my Cottonelle wipes back there, which I love to have. Those right there, the Garnier uh, CBS. Nexus CVS, Pantene CVS, Johnson and Johnson back there. Uh, probably Publix. I'm not really sure. I'm pretty sure these right here, these masks were probably CVS. <laughs> you know what's the crazy thing? The crazy thing about this hair product stuff is that Crystal is only using like flaxseed gel that I boil the seeds and castor oil. That's all I'm putting on my hair right now. So all these extra hair products is just sit. <laughs> all right, let's go to the bottom. Let's go to the bottom. I got the daggum tripod right here. Get it out of the way. Okay, this stuff right here, I will pay full price for this stuff because this stuff is the truth. My sister turned me on to this Marianne of the Coupon Crew, okay? This stuff right here, you spray this stuff in your shower, in your tub. You spray it, let it sit for a minute. Come back with a warm or hot cloth wipes off the soap scum. This stuff is amazing. I will pay full price for this. I don't care if I got a coupon for this or not, but we did buy it with a coupon. All right, so let me move the basket out the way. Y'all know this room is a mess because of the water. Okay, so <laughs> the scotch brights. I don't remember when I bought these. I think I actually bought these doing a spend 50, get a gift card at Target possibly. I got bars of Olay soap right here. These little things, this is our bought a rebate. <laughs> this is our bought a rebate. Ain't used it yet. These little things, our bought a rebates. Ain't used it yet. That's that sheet rock down there, so don't be alarmed. <laughs> That's our bought a rebates back there. This right here, this washing machine stuff. Now, I have used this. I have used this, but it, I still have some because I did our bought a rebates, okay? This toilet stuff right here, these things right here, I have these in my bathroom. So I use those and I love them. And I threw all, you know, toilet brushes away. I will not ever use that again. 
if you're not familiar with what I'm talking about, it's these things right here. Love these things. We got this at a Dollar General clearance event. We got the actual wand and all the little refills. We bought up all the heads. I still have some of these upstairs. So yeah, I love these. And am willing to pay a full price for these if I ever run out. <laughs> Olay. All right, this is some um, scrub and shine. Some stuff you just don't sell. Some stuff you keep. Some stuff you don't give away. Some stuff you keep. This one of them things right here. This right here. Love this product. Got it at Harris Teeter. But now they don't reduce the Swiffer coupon to a dollar. So I don't know if I'm going to ever get that again. <laughs> and that's how I got all of this stuff right here. I'm sitting on the floor, y'all. Because, oof. Okay, all of these bottles right here. I got this bottle, that bottle. Let me get up so y'all can see. I think I got these go to my mop. Okay, I got one, two, three, four bottles. Okay, and then I got one in the mop. Those Harris Teeter, 99 cent. That's it, that's what I'm talking about. That big cascade, uh-oh, I got another bottle behind me. <laughs> that big bottle of cascade, I prefer tabs. But when I run out of tabs, I will use that one, okay? And all my little Swiffer pads. I love my little Swiffer pads. I actually have another one right here. I've gotten those from Dollar General, but the majority of them have come from Harris Teeter Super Double, okay? These right here, I don't even think I paid a dollar for these things. These are little Viva pop-ups. Got these at a Dollar General clearance event love these things okay and my poise harris teeter y'all love harris teeter okay the little poise liners all right these little things i mean they are sanitary product you're going to use them <laughs> next is all the laundry now i'm gonna stand up because i just got too much going on the camera moving all kinds of ways y'all all right now this to deal with this stuff these little small ones Y'all know this was the CVS haul and it ain't been that long ago, but I will, I will use these because they so little. These right here, I think they were CVS. Some of them could probably came from Dollar General as well. I tend to resell this size and then this size right here. Um, this was. I can't remember if I did this at Target or if I did it at Dollar General. I can't remember. But at any rate, look at that monster size Ajax. I think this might have been Family Dollar. I can't remember. <laughs> I don't resell these. I keep these. And I got one at my sink right now. And I've been using off that thing for a minute because it's huge. It's huge. Okay. Let's move on. Let's move on. Let's move up. All right. So my paper products. This is the deal. This is what I do with the paper products. Okay. This size is a uh, CVS. When CVS has it on for five forty nine, you spend twenty get five. That's typically when I get that size. Okay. That's the bigger size. This size right here is the Walgreens size. Y'all know I'm buying them constantly. Okay. Now. I don't run out of paper because I'm constantly buying paper products, okay? That's really not a lot for me. That's only like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and two things of Angel Soft. This is a little bit of paper for me. Normally, I have more paper than this, okay? But it is what it is, okay? Now, this right here, I do believe this, this, and this was either CVS or Dollar General. I can't remember. These were our bottom. <laughs> yes, honey. This was Dollar General. These little hand soaps was probably our bottom. These right here was Harris Teeter, and these will not be sold. These will not be given away. These will be kept because I love the smell of this stuff. <laughs> this right here, uh, I think I Harris Teeter with this, and I do believe these were CBS, I think. I can't remember. I buy them so often, I just can't even keep it straight, to be honest with you. This is my haul from yesterday or day before. I think I posted the video yesterday, so y'all already seen that video. Let's move on to the hodgepodge shelf. Stuff is just, just 
messy and y'all don't care but it's messy okay it's messy because stuff had to be moved to the center of the floor and all my stuff is all out of order and it just is what it is so one little lonely little thing of panting all right all of these simply wipes or these summer's eve wipes love these things had a whole bunch of them i was putting them in bundles and selling them to be honest with you okay i ain't got that many left now all right got this little i bought a swab i think this was a cvs always liners this was something from harris teeter some daggone mess that i don't even use some feminine powder i don't think you're supposed to be putting powder down there with sally i don't think you are. <laughs> I think it causes cancer so not not this but you know putting powder down there i don't think you're supposed to do that so all right so now these right here, these right here is mine. I will keep these. I like this product and I won't be getting rid of those. I won't be giving those away. Next, this was uh, Ibotta, I believe, or uh, Publix Deal. Do believe this was Ibotta. I need to take that upstairs. Cause that stuff, I'm sure smells good. This is my little refill of my little, this was a Dollar General clearance thing, but I have the wand and this is just the, I took one out the pack cause I like these beside my sink. So that's what that is. Ivory, something that's probably not even gonna get used. I need to give that away. Yardley, same thing. Now, some more poise. Done done them at CVS. Y'all see, I got poise for dates. <gasps> Excuse me, poise for days, honey. Now, these good tan packs right here, this was CVS, and I ain't giving them away. I'm keeping them. Add them go expensive ones. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to tell you when I think I got these, because I had a load of this stuff. Y'all remember when Rite Aid changed over to Walgreens in my area, and I was getting these things for the low, low price of darn near free, okay? Yes. I done been using them suckers. The next thing is Physician's Formula. This right here is some kind of cleansing balm. I swear, this right here shows, I don't know what the ham sandwich I got in here. I got some stuff that I ain't even got a clue I got. Some gel, I don't even use no different gel now. I only use flaxseed gel because it don't flake. Um, this right here, Crystal ain't gonna never use this. I need to get this to somebody. Bladder supports. Lord Jesus. Now, how that's supposed to work? I just want y'all to just get your mind around that. Where are you supposed to put that? Easily inserts into the vagina to support the urethra. Oh, okay. I'm about to say. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it's a boy poise baby. I'm about to say that. Mm -mm. That ain't going down. All right. Next. <laughs> You might hear anything come out of my mouth in this stockpile video. Okay, we got some finished tabs. I cannot not buy these things because we use the dishwasher every day in my house. Finish tabs, finish tabs, finish tabs. Nine times out of 10, Harris Teeter. Low, low price of darn near free. Cetaphil, uh, CVS. That was a CVS item, CVS item. These wet ones was definitely, I bought them. This right here, CVS, I'm pretty sure. This was Ibotta. These things right here, I don't even use this deodorant. But for some reason, I bought it at Harris Teeter. I had a whole bunch of these The um, when I had the yard sale and people bought all the little deodorant. Um, the Unstoppables is something that I keep. I, I use them in my house. So I got these and I'm pretty sure they were maybe $2, maybe $1.99. That's for a big, big bottle at Harris Teeter at some point at Super Double. Okay. That is some contact solution back there that I don't even use. And you know what? I need to see if that's the one my husband uses because I don't use that. I got some darn hair color back here. This one I'm talking about. Don't be buying bull crap that you know you ain't going to use, okay? I'm not going to use no permanent color in my hair. I learned my lesson about that. So that's just some black or brown hair color, natural black hair color that somebody can use, but it ain't going to be me. 
okay <laughs> this listerine was at cvs i'm sure y'all recognize that Skin to Mint was probably Harris Teeter Super Double or could have been possibly CVS. Some Gillette Shave Cream. I have no earthly idea when I got that. It might have been Walgreens because I think that's when I got this one at Walgreens. It must have been like a deal or something. This stuff down at the bottom is like paint stuff, junk that y'all don't really care about. Um, Ivory Soap and just bull crap that ain't got nothing to do with y'all but it's cleaning stuff so this way i like to keep my paint stuff and little touch-up stuff and this was crud cutters y'all remember this was a deal that was an amazing deal on ibotta and i got a whole bunch of them down there yeah i use them i use them though i do i use them let's go in this bucket what's in this bucket kevonna crystal i don't know girl <laughs> No, for real, I really don't. <laughs> Face wipes, pawns, CVS, Alme, CVS, CVS, or Walgreens. These were I bought them, the Le Clinex I bought a rebate. And I was supposed to be letting them be like little things to give people for Christmas mixed with other stuff, but I didn't do it. Um, CVS. Definitely CVS. All these face wipes. Jesus, I need to take these things upstairs. These right here I love to have in my car, but I have been putting them in people's bundles. These are Kleenex wet wipes. Little germ, little germ wipes. Wet wipes. This little big pack I will keep for myself because it's the big pack. <laughs> I said a little packs. <laughs> Let me stick my stuff back in. I make it pretty when y'all ain't on the camera with me. Okay, let's move back here. I told you my house is a freaking mess. They don't took my darn molding. Look at my look at my molding gone off the wall. They had to take the molding. I'm just like, Jesus, I'm ready for this to be over. All right, so this is a little lunch box, rubber made lunch box kit that I think I actually got at a Dollar General uh, clearance event, and Crystal ain't used the sucker yet. You know why? Because Crystal has plenty of plastic containers. What the freak do she need that for? That's what I'm talking about. Buying bull crap because you caught up in the sale. Don't get lost in the sauce because you see a sale. Razors. Walgreens. Probably uh, Walmart. This is just a bucket full of razors, okay? These little things I got on clearance at CVS these little things and i've been giving them to people at church okay this is razors razors all of that is razors liners walgreens no 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 hair steeter <laughs> razors 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 Uh oh, oh, look what I found. Oh, crap. Oh, where have you been? I didn't know I had that in there. I don't want that to go back in there. I'm putting it in my car. All right. Let's put these back. I didn't know that was in there. That's what I'm talking about. All right, so let's move over here. Let's move over here. And, uh oh, I forgot a box. Hold on. This is good these diaper boxes i'll be using it for holding my stockpile shoe all right so razor razor hold it back over there this will not be sold i will keep and i'm pretty sure i got this at cvs I always get my mouth washed at cvs probably cost me 99 cent these were 99 cent harris teeter super double you know that's a giant thing of vaseline yeah that's i got one two of those I think they were 99 cent. Uh, this is some Perseo. Pretty sure that was a I bought a rebate at Walmart. And there's another mouthwash. Pretty sure CVS. And let's move on over here. This stuff was in. <laughs> this is like a real ratchet stockpile video. <laughs> 
All right, so this is shampoo and body wash. Y'all know I had to take everything out this room. So I put the stuff in boxes, sat it in my dining room, it got on my nerves, I brought it back in here and decided to have a stop out video for y'all. Yeah, okay. What is this? Olay. Mm, CVS, pretty sure. Got that CVS probably. More Olay. The rest of these are L'Oreal. 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 Pantene's, nine times out of 10, I got a CVS. This I got at Walmart on clearance and it was really darn near free. Um, another Pantene, CVS, pretty sure. Suave, could have possibly been Ibotta Rebate because Ibotta had Suave on Ibotta Rebate for a while. So it could have possibly been Ibotta, okay? Uh, let's see, Pantene, what is this? Whole blends. I may have got this on clearance at Walmart. Not quite sure. Some more suave, some more suave, some more suave. And that's some more of that clearance. Um, I had a coupon. Then I think it was an I bought a rebate. I can't remember, but it was really cheap at Walmart. Or I wouldn't have got it. And there's some more suave. We got some suave tail dryer sheets and some bounce dryer sheets. And my suckers got wet. The freaking box got wet. I was so pissed off. I was just like, oh my gosh, am I gonna throw my dry sheets away? But I can't sell them because the box has gotten wet. But I will keep them for my darn self. I sure will. I will keep them for myself. The box wasn't saturated, but the box got wet. That's the reason why I can't resell them, but I will. The box looks pretty darn good, but you can see it right there. See the box looks funny. Yeah, I'm, I'm keeping them. They mine. I don't care. All right. <laughs> my toothpaste stockpile is like non-existent. You see my past video. I had so much toothpaste. It was unbelievable. I was giving people toothpaste away. Plus, I had sold it in the yard sale more than once. But this all I got right now. I think this and maybe one tube upstairs. That's it. All right, I kept doing Ibotta rebates for the Snuggle and I think the Air Wicks. So that's why I have these. I don't sell these, I keep these. I have one mouthwash there. Y'all know that was CVS. This uh, was definitely a Ibotta rebate at Walmart for the big old box SOS pads. And this is Tide Pods that were nine times out of 10, either I bought a rebate at Walmart or done with the CVS deal, okay? Let me stand up for a bit. Ooh. Now, the reason why I do that is because I resell them, okay? I use them and I resell them. So when they do the I bought a rebate, I'm doing the rebate because I'm using I bought a money anyway, okay? This is my Lazy Susie that is supposed to be on the shelf. It's got Glade candles. What I got left are my Glade candles that I got from Fuline. They had them on clearance. And that's some more air wicks when child ain't gonna tell me. I don't know when I got these things. Okay, so in this here bucket, we have the free little, remember we had the coupon for the free little thing, the free thing like this? And I think you even had it for the Glade too. So every time I went in the store, I just got one. I mean, why the heck wouldn't you get it? They freaking free. I mean, seriously. Yeah, so that's Glade and Airwick. Glade and Airwick refills. Yeah. It was free. I, I was getting it. <laughs> Next is the makeup buckets. Okay. The little drawer that I have all the little makeup. See, I got quite a bit of makeup left. Because I only got one face and I have given makeup away and given makeup away and I still got a bunch of makeup so it is what it is y'all know all this Maybelline and wet and wild is definitely been CVS beauty book situations okay I'm gonna just buy colors I like buy colors I wear and I got more air well little little car things um that's so lit bone supposed to go over here and what's over here Remo. uh some earrings ain't got no business being in there and hair bow ain't got no business being in there uh 
physicians for me. Y'all know that a CVS. All of this is CVS. All of this is CVS. Wet and Wild, Mascara, Maybelline, Revlon, Lip Balm. More earrings ain't supposed to be in there. Lipsticks and lip balm. Stuff that I wear. Colors that I wear. Only pick what I like. Only pick it what I like. <laughs> That's a pretty color. Pretty color. Ooh, that looks pretty. I love matte lipsticks. Lipsticks. Lip balms. Some darn CVS on me, bro. Some more makeup. Mascara. Maybe I need to organize it for all the mascaras in one thing. All the lip balms and lipsticks in one thing. All the eyeshadows in one thing. I think I'm going to do that. Some earring cards. Some classy accents. You need, you need to organize this bull crap crystal. Because this is some foolishness. Yeah. Alright, let's go. Dang, your earring cards. What are these earring cards? Oh, God. That's classy accent stuff. Damn, I'm just here. All right, let's go upstairs. I think my husband's late. Let's see what we got in the cabinet upstairs because I literally have no laundry detergent in the laundry room, so it won't be going in the laundry room. But let's go in the, um, it's like a big cabinet in my bedroom. So let's look at the cabinet, okay? So the cabinet has changed a lot from the last time we went in here, okay? Uh, Hair stuff, but I don't have a lot of hair stuff because I really haven't been buying hair stuff because I told y'all what I'm doing as far as my hair is concerned. So this is just some hair stuff that I have and I love the Shea Moisture products, but I'm not really using that right now. Won't mean that I won't. We got some Aveeno, I'm pretty sure that was CVS. The iron peels, like I told you all, the iron peels, every time I see them, I'm going to buy them. So I have those right there. This is a expensive face product, um, but this was actually found at the Dollar Tree. Okay, so I love this product. Uh, the Nivea Lotion. This was obviously a CVS product, and I love it. Okay, so we've got two bottles of the Nivea. We do have some poise pads back there, some more poise pads. Remember last time I had a whole bunch of caress I really don't now. This was some melatonin that I got at Harris Teeter Super Double, and that stuff does work. It does make you go to sleep. Um, this is some tissue boxes that my sister and I had got at this place that has all kinds of closeout stuff, so that's not really a coupon item. Neutrogena, that was, I think, CVS. I think that was CVS. I got another thing of Aveeno back here. And then... This was a, a Walmart thing, I think. I think I got this at Walmart. Um, yeah, I think I got it at Walmart. I think I have another one of these in the bathroom, so it's just pointless, but only one little lonely bottle of Caress back there. And this is Pantene. This is the little, um, what is it, rescue shots. So that was definitely, I think, Walgreens or CBS. We got washcloths that done fell down here, so we're gonna put them back up. That is, what is this? What is this? this is some clearance, Intense Repair L'Oreal. Found this on the Walmart clearance and it had a Ibotta rebate, so it ended up being free and a money maker, I do believe. That's where that came from. Some more of those Simply wipes, more. Uh, mouthwash. That's all I got left of my little uh, 3D white mouthwash that I love. This right here, somebody gave me these, these little VIP poop things. Um, this right here was actually, I love this stuff. This product, I do love this stuff. This Aussie Curls, this gel oil-like product, I love this stuff. It is a curl defining oil. Matter of fact, I gotta wash my hair tonight, so I might use that because I like that product. I ain't even gonna lie, I like that product, but I love it. I'm loving my Flaxi gel and my um, castor oil. 
All right, so this right here is an MSM. This is a supplement that I not consistently taking, but my husband bought me all of these because we seen them at Vitamin World on clearance was five for five dollars, which was freaking amazing. So, oh, that's my husband's, but yeah, so that's why that's right here. Okay, not a coupon deal. Not a coupon deal. All right. These right here is my Aveeno. This is my face stuff that I use on my face every day. So this was definitely a CVS product. And yes, I love this product. So, you know, I don't know what to say about it. I just love this product and I will be purchasing it probably whether I got some a coupon for it or not. I just like this product. Okay, Vaseline. <laughs> the men's Vaseline pretty sure was a Harris Teeter deal. I'm not going to just buy this unless I have a coupon for it. Um, but I have two back here left. We had more than that. So it had to be pretty cheap. There is some more poo, poop stuff. You're supposed to spray your toilet before you boo-boo. Um, Barbasol. This had to be a deal because this been in here for a minute. It was probably in the last video. I like this lotion. The Jergens Wet Skin Moisturizer Lotion. You put it on when you're wet. I like this lotion. Let's just take a moment. Pause for the calls from Mr. Richard. Mr. Richard's got so much Dove in here. It is ridiculous. We gonna move the little Pepto. Move his vitamins. He is a stickler for his vitamins. Nivea Men, I bought him this, but apparently he don't he don't use it. It's post shave balm. Do you use this, Richard? He nodding his head. No, the hand sandwich he done. <laughs> all right, dang, that's all I got is one thing. Oh Lord, all I got is this one thing of hair, skin, and nail gummies. That is the problem. I take these every day and I'm gonna have to go get me some because uh that's a problem. I only got one in here. Ugh, you need to come up on your coupon and crystal. This right here is a big mug that um I used for my husband's birthday thing. I put um candies and raisin nuts in the bottom of it and then attached snacks that he likes off on sticks and decorated it. It was real cute. I'll try to insert a picture. I think I got a picture. So this is my husband's Dove Stop Pile video. <laughs> it need a whole video. No, I'm just playing. Um, I always buy Dove Men Plus Care body wash shampoo when they have a coupon when it's on sale. So he won't run out. And he has not ran out in years. Have you, Richard? Why he act like he had talk? <laughs> he tells him no. <laughs> Nah, he ain't ran out, y'all. He ain't gonna run out. I think he actually must like this better than he likes the foam because I noticed the foam is pushed to the back. You like the foam? Oh, no, he said he liked the foam. Okay. All right, so moving on down to the bottom, to the bottom of this thing, we got a bunch of this stuff. This is crazy. I still got these Mentos. Mentos gum. Might need to check the dates on that stuff because that stuff been in there a minute. Okay. This is Sally Hansen. Definitely CVS. Uh, Nivea. I think this was some type of deal at C Harris Teeter. Harris Teeter. Nivea lip balms. What else is this? This is some Johnson & Johnson little white things. I think this was a Publix coupon deal. Next, what is under here? Oh, that's the Nivea thing that I set aside. Really ain't much of nothing under here. Shavers, some more Tic Tacs, some more Blistics, hodgepodge of stuff, like for real some masks that we got at Walgreens for your hair. All kinds of stuff that I forgot I put in here. Nail files. Harris Teeter. This is, you know, the Pareil little hand thing, hand sanitizer. Some more Blistex, Blistex, Blistex. What is that? Blistex. 
It's <laughs> Jake Watch. Valentine's Day box. That don't make no sense. I ain't pulling all this stuff out. Y'all see what it is. It's that gum. Look like some face masks, some more ballistics, some razors. That's what it is. Neutrogena. Who is this? Some more darn poise. Some more poise. Nothing pertaining to couponing, okay? So guys, what do you think of the stockpile, okay? The first thing that I want to really reiterate in this video is the fact that this is the purpose for a stockpile. The purpose of a stockpile is that you will have items when you need them. Now just grasp the concept for a moment that I have not consistently couponed for two months like the the video besides my videos that i posted like yesterday i hadn't posted a video i think since maybe like november 7th or something like that so i hadn't posted a video in a minute okay so i didn't have time to coupon and i didn't go to the store and buy anything that i needed <laughs> that's the beauty of couponing and having a stockpile okay it is just a great great thing and I believe even if you are trying to save money you're trying to budget coupon it is really going to be a key to that equation okay let me just say it like this it's not how much money you make it's how much money you save okay so you can be a person that's making what 70 80 thousand a year but if you've got so much debt and so many bills that all of your money is going out the door, it does not matter how much you make because you're not doing anything, implementing anything within your household to keep the savings in house, okay? So because of the fact that I've shopped the sales, I've done the extra bucks with CVS, I've done the register rewards with Walgreens. I had a stockpile of items that I was gonna continually still be using those two months that I wasn't couponing, all right? And as you know, I said in one of my other videos, I do sell out of my stockpile. So how was it possible that I was able to actually not coupon and still sell out of my stockpile and still st have stuff left over? like? That's crazy when you think about it. <laughs> yeah, okay. So if you have not started couponing, I really encourage you to do so. I hope that even if you watch my past videos, it will be helpful for you in learning the process of couponing. If you have questions, please don't hesitate to ask me in the comments below of this video because I want you guys to win. I want you guys to be able to save your money. I want you to live your best life now. And I do believe 2020 is, everybody's using the, the um, saying of perfect vision and everything because you know that's what 2020 vision is but i believe that you know nothing is perfect but we can try to perfect the process okay we can try to perfect the process and if you're trying to do things to the best of your ability and by doing something i do mean processing trying something doing something okay if you can't do anything but learn to coupon which is going to decrease the amount of money that you have going out of your household for your household expenses may it be your groceries or may it be your cleaning products or may it be your body products that you're using to you know clean your body lotion your body you know upkeep your children like all of that stuff it matters it really matters and that little savings adds up and it matters okay so i will get on my soapbox and i will rant <laughs> about saving money i need to get like a big old banner and flag and run through the streets talking about couponing and saving money because i really do believe that it is the key to 
your your come out <laughs> is the key to your come out of, of debt. I hope this video was helpful for you guys. I hope it gave you a little hope into what you can possibly build, what you can possibly do. Um, you can use your stockpile for yourself, for your family members to be a blessing to your community, however you would like to do it. But I think couponing is going to be a beneficial thing to you. So if you have any questions about couponing, just let me know in the comments below of the video and make sure that you go check out my other stockpile videos so you can kind of compare. You can kind of compare because I declare Crystal was a couponing. I was a coupon and chick. <laughs> coupon and chick, okay? Yeah, I coupon now, but I am a strategic couponer now because of the fact I do still sell my stockpile. So I'm strategic about what things I coupon for. And I do find that there are some things that I don't use as much as I used to. So I'm not gonna waste my time, my money, my gas couponing for those things. You should never do that. Don't be just running around tracing every deal. Every deal don't deserve your attention, okay? <laughs> All right, remember, click to save and you will be amazed. Bye-bye.